Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I firstly want to thank all my new subscribers. Each like, each view really gives me the strength to keep going on and keep sharing my makeup journey, my beauty journey, my skincare journey with you and I think that really inspires me and I want to inspire and share that inspiration back with you and I want to let you know that if there's something that you're looking for or something that you're interested in working towards continue doing that because that is going to give you a lot of prosperity a lot of success and it will also make you very very happy because that's something that you enjoy that's your passion and that's where all your creativity comes out now getting back to the video this is going to be a part of the five minute review series my previous and the most loved five minute review until today has been laying right about here and it was of the Fenty Gloss but today I'm doing something different and it's going to be something a little bit more crazy and I probably won't have tested it otherwise. So today I'm starting with lip plumpers. I know that the most known in the market are these two phased lip injection extreme plumper and I had to get my hands on these. They did come out with a few new shades and I will let you know about those in the description box down below. But today what I am testing is the original, the sugar cookie and the pumpkin pie shades. This is part of the travel size pack which is three shades but if you want to look at the full size and if you like any shades from these, do go ahead and buy the full size for 4 grams. I am most excited about pumpkin pie because I like those pumpkin spice lattes, especially in the winters. And it seems to be a very nice muted orange shade, which would really look good on any medium skin tone. So the product does claim that you may experience a slight intense tingle that can last up to 5 to 10 minutes. Apply onto within the perimeter of the lips. If applied on skin, a temporary redness may occur. Now it also says that apart from the plumping formula, it also is very hydrating. Maybe a little too much to say right now, but let's just jump into it. Now here are the three shades. I will be testing them and swatching them on my hand before I actually put them on my lips. So I have tested them on my hand and if you notice the shades don't really show up until the light hits them. Uh, I'm not so sure about this because I'm already starting to feel the stinging sensation on my hands. I'm just gonna grab a paper and start to clean that off because I don't want to be having redness especially on my hands. Let's now try that on the lips. I am gonna remove any product that I've already been wearing because I want the color to really show off. Now that I have removed my lip color, we are gonna get into it with the Too Faced Lip Extreme Injection with the original shade. As you can see, I have applied the original shade and I do not feel any stinging sensation, but I do feel a slight tingling. It isn't uncomfortable. The shimmer is very light. It doesn't really show up as much that I expected it to. Slowly though, I'm starting to feel the tingling to grow to a more uncomfortable situation and I'm not sure how to put that. All in all, just by the look of it, it does give a very beautiful light gloss like finish. And just to point out, the application was very soft, smooth, didn't feel like a lot of those sticky glosses and I feel like this is starting to plump my lips. Even if it is not, at least it's starting to tingle a little bit too much that I am not very comfortable with. The shade does smell of bubblegum, so try not lick it. I'm not sure if my lips do look plumper. If you do see a difference, do let me know in the comment section below. But I'm not really seeing any major difference. So it has been 15 minutes now and I'm still not seeing any plumping action on my lip. The sensation that was a little uncomfortable has also died down. So I'm not sure if it's gonna work, it's not gonna work. If it's gonna take that long to work, I'm not sure whether I'm really ready to invest in a product like this which is obviously not drugstore prices. But rather than waiting, I'm just gonna move on to the next shade because I'm really interested in trying out both Christmas cookie and pumpkin spice. Oh sorry, Christmas cookie and pumpkin spice. So this is Christmas cookie which I'm wearing on my lips. It is a very silver pink shade but it doesn't really show up on my pigmented lips. It does look very similar to the original 
and uh, maybe it's not that deep enough to show on my lips <laughs> and finally I've also tried the pumpkin spice and I'm not really sure about my thoughts here I am still not seeing any difference in the plumping effect I do see a little bit of a deeper toned pigment on my lips and that's probably because it's pumpkin spice it, it was supposed to work it can be used on a daily basis it's not very uncomfortable and i would be absolutely okay to use it i will though run out of it very quickly because it is a travel size but i'm still not sure about the plumping situation but you have to let me know in the comment section because i am absolutely unimpressed by this anyways this was a fun video i enjoyed doing it and sharing it with you so if you enjoyed this too don't forget to smash that like button and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i will see you in my next video but until then you take care love yourself and stay glossy bye